Hello buddies, I welcome you all in the Usatility channel. Now we will understand how to install the Raider Origin on PC therefore we can enjoy with mouse and keyboard on a large screen. No need to keep your eyes on tiny display but it's the time to relax and play Raider Origin on PC. I am going to install this game on my PC to teach you all the steps. Therefore, here we go. The very first thing is to open up our favorite internet browser, in our case Google Chrome, and you are going to click the website located in the description of this video, or in the first pinned comment. Right here is the website link that you need to open. You'll automatically be forwarded to this page of Bluestacks Raider Origin. Install Raider Origin on your computer by using Bluestacks. Bluestacks is an awesome software to download and install virtually any Android game even on a big screen. Go to the option, Download Raider Origin for PC, in order to download this game, the download is finished, this is the file. We click on this file to start it. If agreement or terms show on the screen then you'll definitely need to enter yes and accept them. In order to check out game installer, it's advised to minimize the browser like this. We can set up the directory where to install this game. Directory can be picked by just visiting, Customize Installation. We just leave it as it is, we press back, and then we select the, Install Now, option. It is going to just take a few MBs from the storage of your computer to download this specific file. The download of game depends upon the internet speed. Installing the emulator starts automatically. The installation is finished. As Blue Stacks is installed first time, therefore it is gonna take some time to start. The next task is very important. As a way to get access to Google Play, click on, Sign In. For sign in to Google Play, you'll have to enter email as well as password. You cannot still install this game without sign in because it is a Google Play game. Like we've discussed, we will input email and also password in order to get access to Google account. We have now logged into it, and it welcomes us. To continue installation, we accept the terms of use by clicking, I agree, it asks for creating backup of the system in the cloud but we do not require it so we hit, no. If you do not want to lose your progress in the game then you should make backup in the cloud. As you have seen, we are here in our Google Play account now. If you need to return to the computer's desktop, you should click on this small arrow. Before carrying on, examine the two icons it has made here, Bluestacks and also Bluestacks Multi Instance. If you want to begin Bluestacks app then click, Bluestacks, icon. Now, to set up this game, we will simply click this icon. Now we will try out installing Raider Origin. For this purpose, we open up Google Play in Bluestacks. Installation of the game has been began now, Raider Origin will be downloaded within the system. Faster web connection is advised to complete downloading of the game quickly. Thus, it is now done downloading, and as you can observe, it has now provided an additional icon on the desktop, Raider Origin, that will let us connect to the game without needing to open the blue stacks. Each time when you would like to play the game, double-click Raider Origin icon on your computer's desktop. We could open the game directly from here, however I am going to explain to you how you can do that if we get started in blue stacks. Simply click here to begin Raider Origin and have fun. You can even make changes in the keyboard configurations from this point. We will leave it at the default, we close it. You'd of course enjoy playing Raider Origin even on a big screen. If so you'll then get large screen in two ways. By pressing here on, maximize, bar, the screen will be enhanced. Anyway, the screen will not get 100% large. Either you would like to go into the full screen mode or perhaps go to normal mode, you should click F11. After you will start playing the game in the full screen mode, you will be able to better focus on the game. There isn't any doubt that playing a game in an emulator uses a lot of power hence the overall performance depends upon the power of your computer. Would like to know how you can change the game language? Let's explore it. To alter the game language, select this cogwheel and hit on preferences. This drop down menu will display several languages out of which you can pick any specific language. We have finally changed the game language, see. The game is finally installed. It is ready to play. If this video tutorial was helpful for you then subscribe to Usatility channel and we will be back with new videos. I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial and we will bring a lot more useful videos for all of you. Bye.